The green toxic algae is back, you guys. And Florida's image of sandy beaches and that crystal clear blue water is giving way to a tide of just green muck. The algae is also the focus of a new ad from Democratic candidate Philip Levine. But is this ad for governor putting the blame in the right place? Channel 9's Christopher Heath put the ad to the truth test. It's gross and it's bad for tourism. The green toxic algae has been a problem for years and now it's a campaign issue. Algae pollution is poisoning the water and threatening local jobs. Democrat Philip Levine highlights these problems in a new ad. The answer? Declare a state of emergency now. What Levine doesn't say in the ad is that Governor Rick Scott already did declare a state of emergency on July 9th. But Levine does put forward a solution to fix the problem. And bring in our best ecologist to end this nightmare. So will his solution work? Part of the problem with finding a solution is there's plenty of blame to go around. It. UCF political science professor Dr. Aubrey Jewett notes it's not just about bringing in experts, it's also about money. Money for Everglades restoration and Lake Okeechobee, the bulk of which would need to come from the feds. And Florida Republicans have spent money on these projects, perhaps though not not as much as Democrats would like, which is why we're rating this ad half true. The problem is there, but fixing it is much more complicated and expensive than the ad lets on. Christopher Heath, Channel 9 Eyewitness News.